Hey everyone, welcome to Tacoma Games. I just want to do a quick video to show the progress um, from this coin farm that I set up here after I completed the Summer Delight event. Um, I'm going to make this super quick. I've been had a super busy morning, um, so I haven't been able to get this together as soon as I would have liked. Um, this is just a result of the coin farm. I figured I'd show you guys. I uh, had a little bit of um, passive play yesterday, a couple of hours, and then I was out and I didn't have the greatest service. So what I did is I just um, X'd out of everything because um, I didn't want my phone to go completely dead on me. And then I allowed passive play overnight. I woke up this morning to quite a full board. Um, it wasn't completely full, but I had quite a bit out. And as you can see, I leveled up to a little bit of a higher look, some higher level um, magic coins here. So what I'm going to do is just merge up what I have. Um, oh, this is exactly what I wanted to do. Perfect. Um, so as you can see, and this was with maybe half an hour of active play. Um, I was able to get up to a magic gem of life, which is this nice little crown here. Um, I had two hours of passive play yesterday after I got it set up. I had overnight passive play, maybe around seven hours. And then I had some passive play this morning um, for a couple of hours. And then I had maybe altogether about active, maybe about, I don't know, 15 minutes of active harvesting yesterday. And then about um, maybe 30 minutes to an hour today. Um, if I really, really wanted to grind, then, um, and I had a few hours, I probably could have got up to two of these, um, magic gem of life's, um, I really don't need to grind for coins because, um, I have a bunch of watermelon trees and stuff in my camp. So, um, I did it just for kind of demonstration purposes for you guys. If you've got the time to play and you want to, get some free labor out of the dragons this is a great way to get some coin if you don't have room in your camp or if you don't have a lot of dragon power yet um, and you're finding that you are getting your dragons to sleep super easily um, i also have some um, chests over here so i'll merge these up as high as i can get them open them up see what's in here and then we are done with this board. Um, it looks like we have a couple of events coming up. I think there's a week event oh, um, actually starting tomorrow um, and then a weekend event. So it looks like it's going to be a busy, um, a busy week as far as events go. Let's see here. Sell that. And again, if you can sell whatever's on the board, just get you some extra coin. Merge this up, this up. All right, confirm. Always make sure you take these with you because as soon as that time ends, you cannot come back in and collect anything. That's why I say as soon as you get up to that level 10 or two level nines, whatever you're searching for, go ahead and grab it so you don't for lose out on all of these. I have done that and it sucks. So that is the result of my coin farm. Um, if you have time to active play, like I said, you can really get in here and rack up a couple of those. Um, I've hit two before. I've never gotten any more than that. I usually kind of run out of stamina at that point. Um, so that's it for this quick video. Um, I'm going to go back out here into the world map. We're going to look at the event calendar. I'll see if I can find it. Um, let's see. Where does it here we go. Support. Okay. Let's see. Event info. Summer Delight event that ends today on the 8th. Healing Crystals event begins the 9th, which is tomorrow. And then um, goes through the 12th. Then there's the Magic Mood event from the 12th to the 15th. And then uh, there's a couple more beyond that. Um, there's a camp and chill scheduled, I want to say, for the 23rd. So if anybody has chests, those higher level chests, um, tier 2 nests count for those camp and chills. I'm going to do a video on a camp and chill. I'm going to try to get some tier 2 nests. They 
give the most amount of points for a camp and chill. That's the quickest way I found to um, to complete those because um, they're worth like 900 and some points per tab. So you get a chest with, or no, I'm sorry, not a chest, a nest with four or five, six, seven, eight eggs. You are going to breeze through the camp and chill like there is no tomorrow. So I will do a video on that when that comes up. But if anybody wants to prepare for it, higher level chests, those, those, the biggest chests that you can get, um, level six stars are good. Each one of those taps is like a thousand or something points, if I remember correctly. Um, tier two nests are good. Other than that, I really like high level, um, prism flowers give out a bunch. Um, the event trophies that you can bring back into camp give out a bunch. Um, so yeah, I will definitely do a video on that. Um, when that comes up, that's the 23rd. In the meantime, if anybody has anything in particular they want to, um, some tips or tricks on, if you have specific questions, let me know in the comments. Um, give me a like, give me a subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Hope everyone has a great day.